A massive unicorn tusker got a grievous injury during a must fight between another tusker elephant. The incident unfolded in a dense forest located in Dry Zone. Forest range officers observed this tusker with a punctured wound on its body and quickly informed the wildlife officers for assistance. Accordingly, a team of wildlife officers and a veterinarian quickly mobilized and dispatched to the location. They could spot the elephant hiding in a terrain bit congested with thorny trees and vines. The officers fired a tranquilizer dart to sedate the elephant. When the dart hits the body, the elephant ran few meters towards the forest. Within a few minutes, the sedative drug was active and immobilized the elephant. The officers observed the single tusker for a few minutes, and one officer approached the animal and poked him with a stick, just to confirm whether the elephant is fully sedated. It is not easy to reach the elephant because of thorny trees and bushes. There is a penetrating wound in the elephant's body, which seems to have infected, and it was full of maggots and flies were hovering around. After examining the nature of the injury, the veterinarian confirmed that injury has caused by piercing an elephant's tusk. The officers quickly leapt into actions. To avoid the infection, it is essential to administer antibiotics. Prior to the injections, the officers are scrubbing off the dirt and disinfecting the body of the elephant to avoid further infections through the injection sites. Antibiotics are administered intramuscularly to eliminate the harmful microbes exist in the wound and prevent further infections through the pathogens. In the meantime, another group of officers started cleaning the wound. A cotton swab soaked in disinfectant is used to wipe off the wound. The disinfecting solution is taken into a syringe and injected into the wound. The officers scrape off the infested part of the flesh and clean it thoroughly using more cotton. In such situations, it is important that the wildlife officers and the veterinarians work with proper coordination of each other's role. Time is precious as the treatment should be done within the limited time they have.
The forest rangers have noticed a fierce fight between this elephant with another tusker a few days ago. Such encounters between elephants are not rare, but the ferocity of the fight stunned even the seasoned forest rangers. They did not try to stop the fight because the elephants were not straying into human territory and the battle was the result of their natural instinct. Also, intervention could intensify the anger of elephant and needless to explain the risk of intervening humongous bull elephant who were at the peak of their must. When they enter must, an elevated state of testosterone, male elephants often fight for dominance and mating rights. The intense battle persisted for two days, and ultimately, this single tusked elephant may have been defeated, succumbing to a severe injury inflicted by its opponent's piercing tusk. Painkillers and multivitamins were also administered to alleviate the pain and revitalize the elephant. After a thorough cleaning, antiseptic fly repellent spray was applied on the wound. There were some minor injuries in the back of the elephant too. It might also have caused in the duel between two tuskers. Those wounds were also medicated and externally smeared with bluish antiseptic fly repellent spray. They did every possible actions to save the life of this unicorn tusker. To wind up the treatment for today, revival drug is injected to the tail area of the elephant to reverse the effect of anesthetic drug. The elephant regained its consciousness and slowly moved into the forest. The veterinarian decide to locate him and treat him once again in a few more days. A separate team has appointed to keep an eye on this elephant. The veterinarians say this majestic tusker will recover soon and will shows off his masculinity once again in the region.